And now, Travis Kelsey is a drunky McDrunkerson and a bad influence on Taylor Swift, starring this actress who doesn't personally know him. So Jana Kramer from One Tree Hill, she's also a country star. She was on her podcast called Wine Down and she totally went after Travis Kelsey. Well, to me, I just... he's always drunk. Every time I've ever seen a video, he's just always drunk. And I'm like, so I hope that she doesn't go on that. Like, it's just, you right. see her, I see her drinking more now because of like the company you keep. He gets drunk all the time. Well, this everybody. is not in debate. I actually don't know that we've seen him drunk all the time. Yeah, just some of the time. And some of the other time. And some more of the time. But honestly, what else are you supposed to do with the Lombardi trophy? Oh, I was chugging it. No, no. He was off season then. We're not saying it's a flaw. We're just saying it is true. It's not though. I don't have an issue with her saying that, that he drinks a lot. But to say that he's bad for Taylor Swift? It's obnoxious. I don't think she said he was like bad. She was just like. Something about him reminds me of my ex that I just That's rubs valid. me the wrong way. Her ex-husband and former NFL star, Mike Carson. She had a lot of problems with, who had a lot of aggression, who had a sex addiction, who was drunk a lot but she's projecting her issue onto Taylor Swift. Our Travis Kelsey sources say that he has no idea who Jana is and he thinks she's cloud chasing. It's not that wild if it's a perception that a lot of us have. He's a party guy. True, but the point here is just cause Travis loves to party doesn't mean he's bad for Taylor. In fact, her chugging has definitely improved since being with him. You go, girl! So thanks for your opinion, Jana, and cheers to the happy couple. <laughs>